Meet Kizaloma. It's a badass drone from Turkey. Hello everyone. Welcome to the Sidem MBT channel. Kizaloma, which means red apple, was developed by Baykar, who is responsible for the Bayraktar TB2, a drone that has shown success on a number of battlefields from Azerbaijan to Ukraine. Baykar Turkey Company has begun trials of the Bayraktar Kizaloma drone, which is described as the first unmanned combat aircraft the country has built. Turkey's proud Kizaloma drone is claimed to be a supersonic drone. In addition, it has a low level of observed characteristics and will be able to perform aerial combat missions that usually have to be carried out by manned fighter jets. Powered by a single Ukrainian-designed Ivchenko Progress turbofan engine, the Kizaloma has a canard delta configuration. A feature seen on several stealth fighter designs, including China's J-20 manned fighter. The use of canards will accommodate low observability and maneuverability, while the tail consists of inclined vertical stabilizers. According to technical requirements, the Kizaloma has an endurance of 5 to 6 hours, a combat radius of about 800 kilometers, and an altitude of over 10,000 meters. The maximum takeoff weight is 6,000 kilograms, including a payload of 1,500 kilograms. The payload will be carried in an internal weapons bay that will retain its stealth characteristics. Weapons will likely include precision air-to-ground munitions and air-to-air -air missiles developed by Turkish industry. While the first prototype of Kizaloma and other early versions are planned to be powered by a non-afterburning Ivchenko Progress A25 TLT turbofan, later versions will be replaced by an afterburning Ivchenko Progress at 322F engine. This new engine will ensure supersonic performance. Even with the non-afterburning engine, the Kizaloma offers impressive performance for a drone as it can reach a maximum speed close to Mach 1. Ultimately, there are plans for a twin-engine version with a pair of I-322S. In its initial form, the engine exhaust is definitely not hidden, although the low observable characteristics could be improved by refining this area, something Russia is also doing with its Okotnik drone. But while this aircraft has features to reduce radar cross-section from certain angles, it is clear that high performance is more considered than stealth capabilities. The fast and high-flying Kizaloma is planned to have air-to-air -air combat, intelligence operations, and strike capabilities, but few details are available about the avionics and overall mission architecture. Reportedly, the drone will be equipped with some sort of AESA radar. It is not yet clear whether Kizaloma's overall concept is based on being a companion drone of sorts loyal wingman to manned combat aircraft, or will operate autonomously by being controlled from a ground station, or will even operate autonomously. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to write your comments, subscribe, and like.